18 cinema summary here. Today, I will tell a simple case caused by the internet. Information on the internet is misused and makes the perpetrators can commit crimes. This story will focus on a waxing shop owned by a 30 year old woman. This shop was still quite small, and there were no employees, so the shop was run by the shop owner. For your information, this waxing shop accepts all gender. One day, a man wanted to book waxing at night on July 5, 2017. After making an appointment, a guest came on time. The shop owner carried on a waxing procedure for about 40 minutes. When it was finished and wanted to tidy up everything, this guest suddenly grabbed a weapon and stabbed the shop owner from behind. The shop owner could not move, and the perpetrators of the crime asked for a debit card and also his cell phone. Normally, the perpetrators will run away when they get everything he wants. But, this perpetrator took a shower first. When the perpetrator was finished, he found the shop owner, who had not yet fully died. The perpetrators of the crime killed the woman until she really died. The perpetrator went straight to the cash machine and withdrew some money from the shop owner's card. Not long after, the shop owner's friend came to the shop to find the shop owner. Her friend was surprised because the shop was still open, but no one was there. Then, she found out the shop owner had died and called the police. Because of the development of technology, the police immediately conducted an investigation and succeeded in arresting the perpetrator within seven hours. After being interrogated, it turns out that the perpetrator knew about this place from one of the content creators on the internet. The perpetrator knew that this place was only run by one person, and the location was also remote. A very suitable place to commit crimes. So here is the beginning of the story. There is a content creator that has just reached 100,000 subscribers. His followers challenged him to do waxing. Then he found this waxing place. This content creator had made an appointment and asked permission to take a video. The video benefits all parties. The shop owner gets free advertisements and the content creator gets content. The viewers get new information. Then, this creator provides some information about a remote location and how to contact the owner. In addition, the owner is so gorgeous. However, this information was misused by a 30-year-old man, who was the perpetrator of the murder in this case. It was also reported that the perpetrators did not have a job for the past two years. He also has a lot of debt, which is 6 million won. So, he has no job and a lot of debt, and when watching YouTube, he saw this waxing place. So, from this case, we learn new things. Be careful and be wise when you want to post information on the internet. What do you think about this case? Let me know in the comment down below. Have a great day. Thank you for watching, and see you in the next video.